How's it going everybody? I just thought I'd throw this video out there because not many of you know that I'm a huge, huge football fan. I'm the guy downstairs watching his TV and it sounds like there's 30 people in the room with him. But in actuality, it's just me throwing things, jumping around, doing backflips, yelling at my team, making sure they go. And if you haven't noticed yet, I'm a huge Denver Broncos fan. When I was three years old, everyone else in my family, they liked the Oakland Raiders. I hate the Raiders. I despise them. And there was this quarterback named John Elway. Needless to say, I was hooked. I watched all his games, watched the Broncos win two Super Bowls. I've been hooked my entire life. So anyway, the point of this video is, not only do I like to go shoot guns, you know, I like to do my prepping thing, knives, martial arts, and all that. But I also follow the NFL religiously. And I just want to throw out my top five picks just for the fun of it. So anyway, here we go. Number one, I see Carolina picking Cam Newton. Everything I hear is that they love that kid out of Auburn. And I've been watching his games, and he seems like a perfect fit for Ron Rivera. Number two for my Denver Broncos. I know a lot of people say Marcel Darius, but... I've heard a lot of things by reading articles, watching TV. I have Sirius NFL Radio, and I'll listen to that. I think they're going to go with Von Miller. He's just so gifted at what he does. I think he'll fit into Denver's system. I know he played into 3-4, and we're actually going to go into a 4-3, but he's such a good an athlete, I think he'll make it. Number three to Buffalo. They take the best player on the board, Marcel Darius. It gives him a big guy up front. And it'll help them with their rush and just make their team a lot better. Number four, a little tricky. Cincinnati, they got the whole Carson Palmer thing going around. I think they skipped the quarterback. They played out one year safely. And they would go with the best player on the board also. Patrick Peterson. I know a lot of people haven't predicted that. But he is the best player in the draft. He's on top of Mel Kuyper's board. He's awesome at what he does. So I think they go with him. And number five. Arizona Cardinals. What I see them doing is I know they don't have a great quarterback going, but any of the other players on the board don't particularly fit their style. So I think they go with the quarterback of the future, Blaine Gabbert, and I, that rounds up my top five, guys. So if you guys love football, do a video response to all your top five picks. You know, I just love it. So I'll talk to you guys later, and I'll be watching tomorrow night, and I hope you guys are too.